Hello everybody, this is Mr. Michael and you're watching a brief tutorial about how to install Windows Defender onto your computer. You may ask yourself, why do I need to install Windows Defender on my computer? Well, you need to install Windows Defender on your computer because Defender helps you protect your computer against pop-ups, slow performance issues, and security threats caused by spyware and other unwanted software by deleting and removing spyware from your computer. If at any time during this video tutorial you need more time, you can simply pause or rewind this tutorial. If Windows Defender didn't install after watching this tutorial and following the directions, then simply go back to the beginning and start over. Okay, let's get started. The only materials you'll need will be a functional computer with a keyboard and mouse. You'll also most likely need a computer that's at least running Windows XP. If you have a basic understanding of how to use and navigate your way through the internet, then you should be ready to go. If you have a computer that has Windows Vista or Windows 7, then you should already have Windows Defender installed and will not need to complete this tutorial. If you're using a Mac, you will not have to do this tutorial since Macs normally don't have issues with viruses and things of that nature. You can get to the Windows Defender website two different ways. First, you can simply go to yahoo.com and type in Windows Defender as I did. <clears throat> and you could also click on the uh, Windows Defender homepage and can simply type in the address you see on the screen. And remember, as I said earlier, if you have any issues or problems, you can simply uh, pause the video and rewind it and uh, play it again for your convenience. All right, once you get to this screen, then you can just click on Get It Now. And then you should be able to click on Download. Uh, if yours doesn't pop this little box up, then you can click on the Start Download and it'll uh, bring the box up for you. It should start automatically. Click Save File. Then it will uh, download for you. Okay, this box will come up after it's downloaded and you'll see Run. Click on Run. Next, you'll see this box that says Welcome to Install Wizard for Windows Defender. Click Next. Then you should have uh, this box where you can click on Validate. After clicking Validate, then this box will come up. You can go and uh, make sure you click on the circle, I accept the terms of the license, then click Next. You'll want to go up now and check uh, the Use Recommended Settings and then go down and click next and then complete should be filled in if not click on that and click next and then click on install when it gets to this uh, Windows Defender install complete just click finish now this box will appear and it will say uh, You'll have a pop-up at the bottom, usually to say Windows Defender is checking for updates. And uh, it will check for those for you. You can click on Scan, and it will perform a quick scan for you. Okay, after Windows Defender has run and done its quick scan, it hopefully will say no unwanted or harm harmful uh, software detected. If that is uh, what it does, then you're done you can hit the X and be done if not it will show you the list of what needs to be removed and you can just click remove and you'll be done with that also thank you uh, glad you uh, had time to listen to this tutorial